Previously on Life is Strange Before the Storm. I can't believe Firewalk is playing a show at the old mill. I'm gonna teach this little punk some manners. Hey! Dickhead! Get the fuck out of here! Between your grades and your disregard for my rules, I see you slipping. I'm worried. We don't have to like each other, but you will respect me. Hello, Black Hal. Chloe, do something! Hey, do you know if Rachel's a gamer? How would you like to join me on a little field trip? Don't be surprised, Chloe, if one day I'm just out of here. Let me know if you need an accomplice. Damn, they are really going at it. You remember that? guy that we saw under this tree with that woman that was my dad ah! and that woman was definitely not my mom Miss Price, how good of you to join us. I'm so sorry we're late. My my shift ran late at the diner and then... Just... Sorry. Let us proceed. One of you here is new to the Blackwell disciplinary process. And the other is all too familiar with it. Blackwell's code of conduct is built upon a foundation of mutual respect meant to foster an environment conducive to education and enrichment. When that respect okay. is violated... reality check time. Yesterday did actually happen. I ditched school with Rachel Amber, and then Rachel really did start that fire. And that was after we actually agreed to run away from here. Right? Are you paying attention to me, Chloe? Um, what? Miss Price, the last time we met, an agreement was brokered. Do you recall what that was? Uh, don't get in trouble again? Trouble is merely the byproduct, Miss Price. What's at issue is your attitude. We agreed that you would rededicate yourself to becoming an exemplary Blackwell citizen. We did? In the event that you were unable or unwilling to do so, we also agreed that it would become pertinent to reassess your future status at the Academy. Despite all this, you engaged in the following actions yesterday. Insubordinate language. Disregarding posted signs about trespassing on the stage. Implications of possible drug-related activities. What does that mean? Yes, what does that mean? It means Miss Price has developed a reputation as a user of marijuana. And I would strongly recommend you take a careful look through her room at home. Shall I continue? Witnesses saying you were involved in bullying Nathan Prescott. If involved means not sticking out my neck for Blackwell's richest ass child. I didn't realize that was a crime. Your lack of awareness does not absolve you of anything, Miss Price. Oh, Chloe. Bullying? Maybe you should be talking to Drew instead of me. You know, the guy who actually did what you're accusing me of. Mr. North's situation requires sensitivity. It will be handled separately. Principal Wells, I know this looks bad. Thank you for your validation, Miss Price. May I continue? With your permission? Sorry. And yet, even with your prodigious disciplinary record, Miss Price, we needn't discuss any of it. We needn't? No. Because you severed your relationship with Blackwell the minute you left school grounds without permission. 
What does that mean? It means... You forced my hand. This is a consequence of your actions, Chloe. I have no choice I but to... I need to do it. What? 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 Yesterday was all me. My idea. I was having a bad day. I needed to blow off some steam, and I took it too far. Chloe tried to talk me out of it. I've been down that road, she told me. You're better than this. But I wouldn't listen. See, Chloe was afraid I'd get in trouble or hurt, so she came with me. But only to keep me safe. I'm just sorry you got caught up in it, Chloe. That you allowed me to drag you down to my level. Can you forgive me? Yeah, sure. We're cool. Thank you. I'll make it up to you. I promise. Chloe, is this true? It's true. Totally not true. She really is an amazing actress. Miss Price? Fine, yes. It was her idea, but it's not like she kidnapped me. We were in it together. Miss Amber, based on what you've just told me, I have grounds to punish you. Are you sure what you've told me is the truth? Yes. This can't be the full story, Rachel. Ray! Just to be clear, Miss Amber, you're sure Chloe Price didn't coerce you or... Trick her? Yes, I'm sure. Oh, thank God. Mrs. Price, this revelation may color the situation some, but it in no way absolves your daughter. I understand, Mr. Wells. There is no doubt that Chloe's behavior must improve. But given what we've just learned about the negative influence she was under, I hope you will allow her just one more chance. Miss Amber, I am as surprised as I am disappointed in you. I understand. This being your first infraction in no way reduces its severity. Still, we will not be suspending you at this time. But you have squandered our trust. You will no longer be my administrative assistant first period. And you will no longer be involved in Blackwell's performance of The Tempest. No. But the performance is tonight. For someone so aware of our school calendar, Miss Price, I would expect fewer absences on your record. Ray, she loves that show. Since this is her first infraction, Mr. Don't you Amber, think, uh... I don't tell you how to run the district attorney's office. Please don't tell me how to run my school. There's a reason we have understudies for all circumstances, accidental and deliberate. I'm sure your understudy. Victoria Chase. Yes, I'm sure Victoria Chase will do fine. That is what such... What was that, Miss Price? <sighs> Chloe is upset for her friend, but we are both grateful that she is not going to be unduly blamed for what happened. There is plenty of blame to go around. Chloe's future at Blackwell will be discussed next, unless you had something to add first, Miss Price. Hm, schwierig. <lacht> Entweder wir nehmen die Schuld auf uns oder wir stimmen Rachel zu. Und ich glaube, dass wir so und so suspendiert werden. <lacht> Von dem her, hm, vielleicht sollten wir die Schuld auf uns nehmen. Hm, ich bin mir nicht sicher. Hm. 
ist wirklich keine leichte Entscheidung. Ah. Obwohl. Hm. Ne, versuchen wir mal, dass wir vielleicht die Situation nicht ganz eskalieren lassen. <lacht> Wie wir es normalerweise machen. Also stimmen wir mal Rachel zu. No. Nothing to add. I'm glad. Though Chloe may not have been the mastermind of yesterday's events, it was, as I prefaced, the proverbial last straw. In light of your many past transgressions, I have no choice but to suspend you for the rest of the year. But it was the other girl's idea. She confessed. And she will be punished accordingly. But that does not absolve Chloe of her responsibility. I am truly sorry it has come to this. But Chloe will have the chance for reinstatement in the fall. Her actions beginning now will be weighed heavily in that decision. Do you understand me? Both of you. I understand that you're a fucking Chloe. We understand, Mr. Wells. I will have Skip Matthews escort you to clean out your locker. You may wait outside my office until he arrives. That is all. Good day, Mrs. Price. Mr. and Mrs. Amber. Ray. Come on, Chloe. I'm sorry. I'm sorry, too. Meet me at the junkyard later? You bet. I didn't get the chance to introduce myself. I'm Joyce. Mrs. Price? I'm Rose. This is James. I'm sorry we had to meet like this. No, I'm sorry. I'm sure for you this is an unusual circumstance. We really should be going. Nice to meet you. Mom, I'm... I'll see you. In the parking lot. Hey, Chloe. I'm supposed to walk you out. Just you and me. Hey, Skip. Fuck them. Bunch of fascists. Hey, uh... Just wanted to say... It sucks what is happening to you. Thanks, Skip. You're gonna be missed. I don't really care about any of this shit. Except my secret stash. Might as well grab my emergency joint while I'm here. So. <clears throat> so. Hmm. So. Sachen, die wir mitnehmen können. Und sehr viele Sachen, die wir wegwerfen können. Also schreiben wir erstmal. Hm. So. Die Sachen brauchen wir nicht mehr, also wegwerfen. Nehmen wir mal. Okay. Das Foto. Bücher zum Wegwerfen. So. 
so. Das da hinten können wir auch noch wegwerfen. Und scheinbar haben wir da ein kleines Geheimfach. Fuck every inch of this place. I wish I could tag it from floor to ceiling. But with Skip watching me. Uh, bathroom. Then I'm out. Cool? <sighs> okay. But try to make it fast, will you? Later, Skip. Later. Looks like David's here. Awesome. Okay. Es <lacht> sieht nicht gut aus, wenn David hier ist. Allerdings, glaube ich, werde ich den Part dann an dieser Stelle auch schon wieder beenden. Lasst mir immer eine Bewertung da. Ich würde mich darüber freuen, wenn ihr nichts mehr verpassen wollt. Könnt ihr auch gerne ein Abo da lassen. Und ich hoffe, wir sehen uns in der nächsten Folge von Life is Strange wieder. Ciao.